तुम सी लाले लाल लाले तो तुम सी लाले The first thing you notice about Beatrice are her beautiful long eyelashes. The second is that the eyes behind them are weary and distant. This is the face of her global food crisis. Beatrice is in the early stages of malnutrition. Her arms are like little twigs, she's weak all the time, and an ear infection has left her partially deaf. Lack of food has made her weary and run her small body down. At school, under the big acacia tree, Beatrice can't concentrate or properly hear what the others are saying. She is falling behind. <coughs> Her world is becoming a haze. Her new sister is only two months old and her mum isn't able to go out and work for food. The kilo of beans used to be 40 and now it's 80. So in a period of one year that's doubled. Yeah, doubled. So there's some days where the children don't eat anything at all. They go to bed hungry. Have they eaten today? Beatrice's mum is so malnourished, she can't make enough breast milk for her two-month-old baby. Her little sister cries late into the night from hunger pains. When she can, Beatrice helps by singing her back to sleep. The global food crisis means this family can only afford the cheapest meal on earth, a porridge made from maize flour and dirty water. It has hardly any nutritional value. It tastes like nothing and there is never enough. Beatrice's one toy is a battery. She chewed off the top, scooped out the chemicals and made herself a toy saucepan. She plays a cooking game with a pretend fire and goat droppings. In her game, there is always enough.